Greetings loved ones and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I'm doing one of those things where I'm just like, I can't believe this is my life. <laughs> Today I'm going to be giving my pigs the spa day that they deserve because oh my god we have a scratcher. Ducky is literally just between my legs right now and like scratching her head violently against my calf. So she's gonna get some nice exfoliating done today. Um, I really wanted to do this because I have never given my pigs a bath in like the year and a half that we've owned them because pigs are generally like, they lay in the mud, they're very dirty girls, <laughs> they keep up with themselves. The most you have to do is like trim their hooves and obviously like feed them and keep up with them and stuff, clean up their poop. But um, pigs are very self-sufficient animals and I just wanna give them like a nice special treatment today. They love water, it's really hot out today. So I got my sunscreen on, I got my bathing suit on, um, it's very sunny, so I can't really see the frame right now, but um, let's just go ahead and start bathing these girls. I made them a homemade shampoo with dish liquid, no essential oils because I'm not sure if they're safe to use on pigs. I don't use essential oils on any animals, just myself. And then I just put in like a cup of water, a teaspoon of mineral oil, and a teaspoon of table salt. And I shook it all up. So that's what's in here. I'm going to be doing some washing of them, some exfoliating of them. You'll see as the day goes on. I'm just going to give them all of their special treatments and the things that they love and enjoy. Okay, let's get started. Is that nice? <laughs> Yeah, I need to take my shoes off. You guys are gonna get me really wet. Wow, that's so nice, Ducky. That's so nice, Peachy. I also wanted to do this because <laughs> Cooney Cooney pigs, like themselves, they shed their coats in the summer when it gets to be really hot. And so I just wanted to like exfoliate them to get all of their, their old coat off as well. Wow, that's so nice. Okay, who wants to go first? You peachy weechy? Wow! Wow! <laughs> Don't knock this over. Okay, Ducky, I already know what you're gonna do. You're gonna knock it over. <laughs> this is absurd. I'm so glad I'm in a swimsuit. <laughs> wow! Oh, Ducky. <laughs> she loves a good scratch. Look at you getting all lathered up. Oh my god. <laughs> you want it all over your head? Okay. Oh my god, I'm just covered in pig hair right now. You guys are really losing your coats, huh? Okay, hold on, I need to get your exfoliating brush. I have this dry brush that I never use for myself, so I figure I'll just donate it to their coats. <laughs> you need a little bit more. Some more for you. Some more for you. No, you can't eat the jar. These girls are crazy. Do you see her just throwing herself on to me right now? She loves this scratch right now. Wow. Ducky's throwing it back. Oh, baby girl, will you show me your belly? Yes. That's okay. Peachy, you are losing so much hair. The amount of hair that I just pulled out of this brush is insane. Okay, I need to see some bellies. Ducky loves her head scratched. Yeah, your cheeks. I'll get your cheeks. <laughs> She's just loving right now. She is living for it. Peachy's turn for a little face massage. We are just exfoliating away all of that dead skin, Ducky. Just forget about it. You're gonna be a new woman after this. So soft. I don't know why they're not showing me their bellies, because they love a good belly rub. Okay. I need more soap. My hair's also falling out. 
of this fun. This is so much dirtier than I even anticipated bathing with hogs would be. I'm going to need to bathe myself fully after this. Who's gonna give me their butt? Come over here. Who's gonna give me their butt to do a scratch up? Miss Peach? Come over here. Good girl. Little pig bottom. Mrs. Pig bottom. <sighs> Are you going to the bathroom, Ducky? Ducky's already back in the mud back there. Okay, that was crazy. I'm washing me and my clothes. <laughs> Come back here. Where are you going? Why are they leaving me? <laughs> okay, both pigs just left me, so I guess I need to get some food to entice them to come back to hang out with me. The secret to getting pigs to love you is just food. <laughs> Always food. Oh no. <laughs> I knew as soon as I would be done washing them with soap, they would just get into their mud bath. Like the freaking hogs they are. Now that they know I have their food, they won't be going anywhere. Yeah, I freaking know that. Okay. Just hang out out here, okay? Wash off this disgusting brush. Oh my god, Ducky's leaving again. Dang it. Now, if there's one thing that I also know about a couple of fat hogs is that they love coconut oil. But I need to put it on their skin as a little bit of a moisturizer. Wow, that's so nice. I'm just gonna pour some more out so I don't have to put my hand back in there. I use this for myself as well. Do you want some? They're literally just licking the ground where it was. You love coconut oil. Yeah. Yeah. I put it on you. That's where it went, Ducky. Wow, you're so soft. <laughs> hey. Ducky. You're the one who's being freaking annoying. Peachy's being a good girl. I think they were expecting that I would give them some more coconut oil to eat. The next thing that pigs love to do other than get wet is look for food, root around for food. So I'm going to put some sunflower seeds out in this little dry patch back here that I just put a little bit of water over so like the dirt would be looser for them and I'm just gonna let them root around for a little bit and then I'm gonna go find a either a soccer ball or a basketball for them to play with because pigs also love balls. <laughs> I know Ducky the sunflower seed monster wants some of these. Yeah. Peachy, do you wanna come over here? Look at that glistening coat, queen. Yes. You're just finding, oh, <laughs> you're just finding some little sunflower seeds. You love sunflower seeds. Ducky's favorite snack and favorite activity is to root around for sunflower seeds. Also scratching herself on various surfaces and hay bales. And I see one big peachy weechy coming out here to join her. Hi, Peach. Come on over. Yeah, it's the party over here. Wow. That's some wagging tail action if I've ever seen some. I love your glistening coat. You're looking incredible. No more dry skin for you. No more flaky flakes. No, no, no. Can I get a little peachy weechy action over here? You love to be the cutest, be sure. Okay, I'm gonna go find you guys a ball to play with. Okay, I brought two more freaking awesome things. One, comfrey. These girls love comfrey. It grows naturally in our yard and it's used a lot of times for like wounds and bruises and stuff like that. And pigs, if they get too fat, they can get really bad joint problems. So I hope that this will help them 
over time. I mean, they literally have so much time free every day because we have so much. And Ducky just freaking loves it. So I brought them that as a treat. And then I also brought you guys this if you want to play it all. Do you want to play it all? <laughs> she hit it, but she doesn't even care because there's food. Do you even care? What about you, Peachy? They don't care because it's not food. <laughs> wow, I think I've lost them to the food. At least you have a beautiful shiny coat. Yeah. You love to look for sunflower seeds, it seems. <laughs> You're crazy. <laughs> Come free monster. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> Wow, she's giving you those pig ASMR moments right now. I love your curly Q tail, ducky. You guys are just living your best life today. Oh, I see you playing with a little bit of ball. Okay, well, while they're eating, I'm gonna show you some funny things about pigs. They have this sweet spot right here that makes them lift their leg when they're getting a good scratch by their butt. Also, if you go behind their ears, oftentimes they'll shake their heads. Okay, well, I guess that's not happening. They're too distracted. Is this your dream day? Me just in here feeding you, massaging you, giving you a good belly rub, peachy weechy. I know you love a good belly rub. Sometimes when they're eating, they fall over because of the belly rubs. Yeah, it almost happened. Please. Yes. Yes, and she's still eating. <laughs> Wow, what a life you live, Peachy. Just getting to eat and be fat and get a good belly rub. Peach is much more prone to falling over for belly rubs. And I think Ducky generally does it less because she's deaf and I think it makes her feel like she's really vulnerable if she's like on her side as well as can't hear anything around her. So whenever she does fall over, she always picks herself up pretty quickly <laughs> and is like, yeah, okay, I'll let you scratch me for a second, but not for too long. <laughs> Can I have a kiss? <laughs> I'm gonna go try to get a kiss from my other queen. Um, Miss Ducky, can I have a kiss? What about if I was a sunflower seed? Would you pay as much attention to me as you are to them? We'll have to wait on the smooches, I guess. I know some of you are probably generally disgusted that I'm walking around barefoot in my pig pet, but I would just like to say that pigs, they don't shit everywhere. They only shit around the perimeter of their pen. So as long as I don't walk barefoot around the perimeter, I'm good. <laughs> and we do a pretty decent job, well Finley does, at cleaning up the poo and putting it in our manure pile so we can use it on our garden. But yeah, their poo is like in that corner. They normally pick like one spot to poo and just kind of keep it there. But a lot of other farm animals like poop everywhere. They just, they don't stop pooping, especially goats. I've heard that goats are really hard to keep clean and whatnot. I want to do this video. I wish I had a GoPro or something. I'm literally covered in dirt. I wanted to do this video where I put a like secret camera in their pen and just see what they do all day and then upload it. <laughs> so if I ever find a camera that can record for hours on end and show their daily routines, I'll do that. Hi, Miss Ducky. Hi. Oh, oh. <laughs> I'm gonna try to play ball with them again, see if they're interested. Check this out, lady. You only like to play when you can eat it like a cabbage. I'm not interested. I love you, Ducky. You're such a coconut oil queen. I love you, Peachy Weechy. Oh, there it is. <laughs> when you scratch behind their ears and they just gotta shake it off. It also makes the hair on the back of their neck stand up. Here's a little ear massage for you. There you go. And while we're here, I'll tell you some facts about my pigs. Other than the fact that Ducky is deaf, she is the goofball of the group, or of the two, and um, Ducky really just follows around whatever Peach does for the most part. Peach is very independent. We got them in April of 2018, so it's been a year and four months that we've had them. They're almost a year and a half old. I think they each weigh about like 180 pounds or something absurd. And basically all they do all day is eat. When they see me in the garden on the other side of this fence, they make a lot of noise so that I'll throw them comfrey. 
their favorite snack. Ducky loves, hello, come here, come on out, come back out. Ducky is the sunflower seed queen. She loves to root and she loves to root against people's bodies and legs and stuff too. Yeah, I'm talking about you, Mrs. Big Fatty. Hi. Hi. And they're just the sweetest pets to have, seriously. They're so much fun. They're so easy. They're like dogs. Ducky is the only one who will sit for me. Like I said, Peachy's pretty independent, so she doesn't so much like to follow orders. But if Ducky wasn't so in on her sunflower seeds right now, I would most definitely try to get her to sit for you guys. Will you show the camera your pretty faces? Yeah. <laughs> okay, my camera's on low battery, so I'm gonna uncover this and give them some food to go. Yeah, there you go. And just say thank you so much for watching. Can you say thank you for watching, Peachy? Oh! I have the fruit, the food monster coming over. Yeah, that's for you. Oh, I knew that would happen at least once in this. A freaking hoof to the foot, huh? And on that note, I'm getting the hell out of here. Thank you for coming to watch me and my two fat hogs. I love them so much. Miss Peach is right here cuddling me. Ignoring me, actually, is how I should put that. This was a ravishing time. Um, I'm feeling really like they've gotten the full treatment of their skin, at least, which was what I really wanted. Hopefully I'll spot them outside today. Hi, Ducky. Playing with the ball or something. I'm very hopeful for that. And who knows, probably as soon as I turn my back, they're gonna go and get into their mud pit again. Yes, you have gorgeous glistening coats. I'm gonna go bathe myself now because oh boy, do I need it. Okay, if you enjoyed this video and wanna see more content of my pigs, give this video a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below. <laughs> Hi Peach. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're not already. Ring the notifications bell if you would like to be notified when I upload. And until the next upload, stay smiling. Bye guys. Say bye Miss Peach. Oh, bye. Say bye Miss Ducky. I just need a little honker out of you. Love you, love you, love you, love you, love you. Love you, love you, love you. Love you, love you, love you.